Hi, and welcome back. I have been using the MAC, my MAC Single Eyeshadows for the last two weeks as I was taking a break from my Pan That Palette, Tamana Palette. Um, I love my eyeshadows. I'm not ready to give them up. I love them. I have been enjoying the living heck out of my eyeshadows. Um, out of my singles. Yes. I used them today. But it is time for me to put my singles away and get back into my Tamana palette. I have used this a few times. I went and used blush um, for my inner corner and I accidentally broke off a piece. I don't know if you can see. Probably not. Right there. I accidentally broke off a piece of blush. Um, that was kind of a, oops, my bad. I wasn't going to try and I was not going to try and save it from the ground though, that's kind of gross. Um, I do have cats and kids, so yeah. I don't want it to break though, I think I'm going to repress blush just to keep it from not breaking any further. Um, Probably going to do that like right now, maybe. No, never mind, I'm not going to repress it, I, it's easy enough for me to just use my brush. Okay, never mind. My MAC Singles, I have thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed using these this week, or these last two weeks. At the end of this video will be my eye of the day picks that I did take with the colors listed that I used for each of the pictures. Um, I don't have a whole lot to say. I love MAC eyeshadows. They're my, I would say my all-time favorite eyeshadow formula because I know what it's going to do when I want it to do it, and I'm not really ever disappointed by their performance, if that makes sense. I hope that makes sense. It's the eyeshadow that I started out with and I will probably continue to purchase MAC eyeshadows for the rest of my life. I don't even know if I would say that I have favorite ones that I used this week except for Sushi Flower and Stars and Rockets, but you guys are probably tired of hearing me say that because I always say Sushi Flower, and Stars and Rockets, but those are the two that I am trying to pan this year, and honestly, they're my two favorite eyeshadows in the entire world. Other than that, let me think. Um, Coral from MAC. It's freaking amazing. Duds from MAC. How many times are we going to say MAC up in this video? I'm wearing Coral today in my crease. I like that one. Um, another one that I like is Vapor. This one is beige-ish skin colored, but it's got a little bit of a glimmer in there. So you can't even see it on my arm. It's a good brow bone color. Also, what was the other one that I was enjoying? Arena. This looks really good with Bangle in my Tamana palette. It's kind of a boring color, but you know what? I love it. It's like a really more lighter, shimmery version of Bangle. What else? What else? Oh yeah. And then a cooler tone eyeshadow is Quarry. This one I really like with purple eyeshadows. Um, it tends to go really well and I'm really glad that I have that one. So those are a few of the ones that I just really liked this week. Some goals for the Tamana palette. Um, I'm going to keep working on blush. I would like to see half of that gone. Whether I do it or not, I don't know. Like, it's practically gone though. I will keep working on Bangle. This one in my crease brow bone is always a favorite. Um, I plan to use the teal more now that it's nice outside. The is just it's so pretty and I need to use it. Nor, I never expected to get that one finished. And Gilded and Custom, I never really have goals for because they're not two of my favorites. But yeah, anyways, um, I will see you in two weeks with an update on my Pan That palette. Two weeks, one palette. Anyways, it's basically my Pan That palette. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and stay tuned for my eyeshadow looks at the end of this and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Last two weeks. I'm gonna be sad to see them and put away in my drawer. Okay, so